So let me start with the positives. They were all positive. There was absolutely no negative um, element at all in this whole trip. I met Laura at a workshop, and I really didn't know Laura that well, but I started um, corresponding with her and started seeing a lot of great things that she was doing in, in Portland. And she was making some amazing connections, and I thought, if anybody, this person has done it. Laura's made connections with some of these artists from Spain that um, have, been, have come over, they've embraced Laura, and have done some amazing workshops in Portland. So I really wanted to be a part of that. And I attended a Whatever. workshop with uh, Manuel and really, really loved it. So Laura told me about this trip to Jerez, and she started explaining to me what it was. And I was instantly in intrigued because it sounded exactly like what I wanted to do. Being a dance teacher and instructor, um, I've had students asking me, I want to go to Spain, how do I do it? And um, I, I've gone to study, but I really, truly did not fully experience what I wanted to experience. And when Laura talked about going with a small group, having intimate classes uh, geared towards our abilities, and our abilities were wide uh, from very experienced dancers to beginners. And with Mercedes, it was absolutely amazing that she was able to address everybody's individual needs. I don't think one of us uh, really came out of that without feeling like we each personally got something um, unique that we couldn't experience anywhere else. So the, the classes were amazing, both with Mercedes and with Annie, and that Bulerias class with Annie was just a kick. We had so much fun. <laughs> uh, the best part for me, and after just talking to all the other participants, was the camaraderie between the group. Um, we all came from different walks of life. We have different experiences, and yet the flamenco was what connected us. And so we can't really talk about certain aspects of our flamenco other life with our family members. They just don't get it. They don't, their eyes glaze over when we start talking about this class and <laughs> this palo. And so for us to be able to congregate in that beautiful city and just um, be immersed in the whole experience was something I'll never forget. So thank you, Laura. This is something that I want to do again and I will do again, um, specifically because of Laura's vision, her organization. We went there feeling um, like we were safe in the area that we were in. There wasn't any question of what was going to happen. Things were just set in place for us. We arrived. Everything was taken care of. It was money well spent, and um, I hope to do it again. And you should too.